I will show you how to find, download, and install Omnibot. And secondly, how to start Omnibot and open an RTCV multiplayer map. GitHub, Jeremy Swigard. Omnibot. And then we click on releases down here. For RTCV, it's the RTCV Omnibot link. Currently, it's version 0 0.91. You, you can use an old version if you want. 0 0.86, for example. Just make sure that you click the RTCV zip file and download it and unpack it onto your desktop or anywhere on your computer. It's just two folders. And you take these two folders and you drag it into your RTCV installation. That's it. Now you have installed the Omnibot system. Let's open the second folder, the Omni-Bot folder, and then click on RTCV, Nav. And here you will see some examples of Omnibot files for maps. For example, the classic map MP Beach. And there are always three files for each map when it comes to Omnibotting. One with the script. It looks like this. And one with the goals. And it looks like this. Every entry into this file is a separate goal for the bots, depending on which team they belong to, of course. Here's a plant goal. See, it says plant the seawall breach. The third and final file is the waypoint file. And it looks like shit, so we never open that one. In summary, each map has a script file, a goal file, and a waypoint file. Enough talking, let's take a look inside the game. Double click on the executable to launch Return to Castle Wolfenstein multiplayer. Okay, we're inside the game. And the first thing you need to do is to activate the Omnibot modification. So start by clicking on Option, and then click on Mods, and select the Omnibot mod, and launch it. The screen will go black for a couple of seconds. That's normal. Then bring down the console by pressing the tilde key and type slash dev map space and the name of your map and press the enter key okay we're inside the game let's bring down the console and we can verify that we have successfully launched the omnibot system i'm using version 0.87 and of course, you can use whatever version you like, as long as it works for you. Bring down the console, slash, bot, and then type AB, space, 10. AB is an abbreviation for add bots. And press the enter key. So we have added a total of 10 bots. I could end the video now because now you know how to download and install the Omnibot system and launch MP Beach. But I want to show you some more tricks. Bot space draw underscore goals and the digit one. Now we can see all the gold that are in the map. And remember, these goals are not produced by the original game developers. Some of the goals are created automatically by the Omnibot system, and some of the goals manually. I'll show you how to do that in a later video.
Are you ready for something spectacular? Bring down the console, slash, bot, space, waypoint, underscore, view, space, and the digit one. Here we go. Holy macaroni, what is this? Let's no clip, slash, no clip, and press the enter key. So we can fly around and take a look from above. These are the so-called waypoints. These are not created by the original game developers from the original game in 2001. These waypoints are created by the Omnibot producer. What are the waypoints? Well, the waypoints are navigation points to help the bots navigate the map. I'm gonna plant here, but first we're gonna kick all the bots. So bring down the console, type slash bot space kick all and press the enter key on your keyboard. And to turn off the waypoint view, just bring up waypoint bot waypoint view zero. And they are gone. We can also remove the goals. Draw goals, zero. And they are also gone. Okay, we are about to end this video, but I want to show you one more thing. It's pretty important. Bring down the console and type slash bot space debug triggers to turn it on. And what is that? Well, let's do something. Let's plant here. Dynamite planted. And if I bring down the console, you can see that there's some sort of information here. It says planted at the seawall door. That command text is very important. We're gonna use it in a future video when we create our own Omnibot files. It's the same thing here. Once I grab them, Taken. There's a new text line here. It says, Allies have stolen the war documents! Exclamation seconds, point. So these text lines, these hidden command texts are very important when creating Omnibot files. And in another video, I'll teach you how to create these three Omnibot files that you must have. Until then, stay safe.